In this video, I will demonstrate how to find the inverse of a function graphically. From the definition of an inverse function, we know that if f of x equals y, then the inverse function of y is equal to x. And because of this, we can graph the function, given its inverse function, about the line y equals x. And here it is dotted in red the line y equals x. It is a diagonal line through the origin. And for each point on our original function f, for instance, this point is 2 comma 8, the value of x that we used to have 2 is now going to be the y coordinate for our inverse function. And 8, the y value, will now become the x coordinate of our new point for the inverse function. So here we have the point 8, 2, and that's going to help us form our inverse function. We also can see a point here at negative 2, comma, negative 8. And reversing the coordinates of that point, we have negative 8, comma, negative 2. And using those two points, and also this point here at the origin, 0, 0, switching 0, 0 is still going to be 0, 0. So using that information and the line of y equals x, we can see the graph And I'll just label this f inverse. And that is how you find the inverse of function graphically uh, re by a reflection of the line y equals x.